the world, I've got an announcement to make. Science is hot again. That's true. And Nick Uhas is the proof. That's right. He is here right now. He's the perfect combination of sexy, of smart, and of science. His experiments <laughs> have gone global, uh, viral, and also in other forms of the media. YouTube mainly, he is an absolutely sensational young fella. Super smart, as I said. Nick, good morning to you. Welcome to Australia. Absolutely. Thank you so much. As you know, I'm a huge fan of yours yes. um, from uh, YouTube. And mm -hmm. it's so good to have you out here in Australia because I saw on YouTube, Lisa, yep. him do a barbecue using Doritos as the fuel. That's How does right. that work, my friend? So most people don't think Doritos are flammable, but they're very flammable. Are the they? actual Dorito is a carbon-based wafer, same thing as wood or coal. They're covered in a hydrocarbon, the same thing as gasoline. So it's like a powdered gasoline. And we're going to So that's show stuff you that, that goes on your fingers. Yes. Um, that's the stuff that's really... The, like the cheesiness yeah. Yeah. is actually the most flammable, flammable part of it. That's so interesting. So yeah, so we're going to go ahead and show you guys here. All right, going to light the corner over here. Whoa. All right, so that's just getting the reaction started here. Now we have a whole barbecue full of it. Wow. And so there is enough calories, enough energy in these Doritos to cook an entire steak. I don't see, I didn't believe that, um, but well, we better light it up and see how we go. See, there's going to be a lot of people. It's kind of windy out here. That's Not, actually a real worry. It, well, especially if you're one of those people up in Nimbin or whatever <laughs> <laughs> on a Friday night. Here we go. All right, okay. so go ahead and toss it on there. What happened? Okay. We're gonna have, gonna light it. We're just gonna light it up there. There we go. Okay. Get out of town. Whoa! <laughs> what a waste of Doritos. <laughs> <laughs> well, not if you can cook a steak with yeah, it. So, okay. Steak over so here? we're gonna have, I'm gonna throw this on here, and then yeah. I'm gonna put you the actual <laughs> steaks on there. <laughs> so it's. it's <laughs> try to get it on here without getting burnt. Okay. So, so how long would those Doritos cook for? This will burn for about an hour. An hour. Get an out. entire hour. I swear. We did right. the experiment back it's home. Frightening. So, okay. Okay. Just whack a steak so, on yeah. So go ahead and put the steak on there. Now, as you guys are doing this, I'm going to pull one of these down. And so will that, will that get the flavor of Doritos in it? Oh, I so it's, it's up, to, Lisa. It's up oh. to speculation. Oh, the flavor of fluorocarbon, yes. probably, more likely. Exactly. OK. But, yeah, <laughs> give that about 10 minutes, yeah. and we'll be good. Right OK. On. OK, so you got the thing so we got something else here. So yeah. yeah, so we have two different balloons here. One's helium, and one is this very special gas called sulfur hexafluoride. Yeah. All right? So with helium, I'm going to cut the top off here. You can actually. Hold these scissors here and mm -hmm. cut the top off that right there. Don't want to get a yep. finger. Right there. Perfect. You're a guest in this country. So I'm going to give you one of these. Okay, now you can feel that they're already heavier, right? It doesn't really feel quite like a balloon. It's... Oh, yeah. So I'm going to have you do the same thing on that one. Cut the top off. You I'll guys can work up. that out. Am I... You ready? Have I got to hold well, you yeah, underneath you the gas in there? Yeah. There you go. There you go. Okay, so I'm going to show you what this does, healing does. What does this do? Oh, we need to cut it a little more here. All right, there. Perfect. Okay, there we go. Look at the steak going. Okay, so helium obviously makes your voice very <laughs> high, right? Yes. And that's because it's six times lighter than air. This gas is five times denser than air. So right. go ahead and take a hit of the sulfur hexafluoride. So I'm taking a breath. Yep, take a breath off that. Here we go. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's so sexy. Oh. So yeah, here, here. I'm, I'm just so horrible. <laughs> <laughs> That's a real worry. <laughs> That's the best thing ever. Here you go, Charles. Yeah, give me yeah, a go. So here we go. If you want to hold that right there, yeah. take this. Here, cut the top off that one. Oh, oh dear. Yep. Here we go. Oh. Okay. Do it together. Now, this is all yours. Okay. How much? Oh. Now, take as much as you can in your lungs, and then take a deep breath out afterwards. Yeah, it's going out with the breaths. And uh, you're watching today right across Australia. This is unreal. Hey, do you hear my voice? Is it all right? Is it sounding good? Pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> So that's what we call oh, dude, that's the yeah, deep voice cool. gas. That's like very cool. The force. You should be the an force. FM radio talk. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, welcome back to the show. we got a big giveaway coming up. $120,000. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, smoking. Okay, so the last piece we have over here. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> We have what is known as the... Woo! <laughs> <laughs> so right, okay, last, last one. This is the last piece over here. Whoa. So, this is what is called the poor steak. man's liquid nitrogen. Now, if you take methylated spirits and you put 
uh, dry ice in here, you'll get this solution down here to about negative 75 degrees Celsius. And so what we did, since you guys don't quite have pumpkins like how we do in the US, yeah. we decided that we were going to carve our first ever, world's first watermelon jack lantern. Yeah. The world's first TV shattering of a watermelon jack lantern. So we have over here a cricket bat. So we're gonna See, place I told this you this here. new house was unbelievable. It's very cool. I'm gonna put this actually upside down because it's gonna break otherwise. Yeah. So that is frozen rock solid so right now. So when it? you have liquid nitrogen, it freezes things down to the point where they're very brittle, right? Yeah. Yep. And so just like a Christmas ornament, our watermelon is now ready to be shattered. Get out. A million pieces. So whoever would like to do the honors do do with the cricket okay, bat. I'll do it. All right, I'm going to step back because, you know, science can get crazy. You've got to aim over there for the security guard. Yeah, there you go. So I'm going, I'm going ahead, am yeah. I? Let's okay. have more now, of it's so stuff. frozen, so brittle. Now make sure you really get a good whack at it, all right? Okay. All right. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Ready? Okay. Oh, yeah! <laughs> See, that's how you do it, Michael Clark. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Lisa. <laughs> wow. That's actually really satisfying. You got another one of those. <laughs> on the YouTube channel, all the details are on our website. Oh, this stuff is unreal. <laughs> right, I know I'm, looking, I'm, looking, I'm, looking. <laughs> I'm coming over to your place tonight. Okay. Oh, hang on. Yeah, it's the way it goes. The way it goes, people. Look at the hair. It's never, we've never been sexier, Lisa, you and I. We've got a whole lot of hair, including $120 million. Nick Newhouse, <laughs> YouTube <laughs> channel. Thank you so much. Thanks, bro. Thank you, guys. Thank you. 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 Thank you